Hey, HCG family. Um, it's just me. I'm checking in for a Thursday here on the VLCD, and it's number 11 today. And I had an Apple Day yesterday, and my results from the Apple Day were that I lost two pounds. I ate about five apples, and uh, I always shoot for six. They were small apples, like the organic ones, and uh, I didn't get them in. And at 9 o'clock last night, I did the Smooth Move Tea, which was a bad idea, okay? I woke up at 3 o'clock this morning going to the bathroom, and that disturbed my sleep. And I didn't go to sleep till late last night because I was talking to another hcg -er on here. Had great time talking to you. You know who you were. And um, anyway, uh, I'm checking in today with a weight of 160.3 on the Wii. My health meter actually put me in 159. So I'm happy about that. Um, I'm still battling a little bit of dizziness today. I've made this vlog three times. This is my third time. I deleted the other ones because I just got a phone call. From Rosanna, Brazilian girl, 36. Her, she just found out that her mother has gone blind. Um, Rosanna is really upset. I want you guys to please keep her in your prayers. Keep her family in her prayers. She's probably going to have to leave sooner than she thought to go back to Brazil. And um, the financial situation and everything. So she is under a lot of stress and a lot of pressure. And she wants to be with her family like yesterday. And so she wanted me to mention that to you guys. So please go right on her profile. Text her. Email her. Message her. Facebook her. Do something. Just let her know that you care. And um, also um, just wanted to check in. Oh, it was... Um, now let me see if I can think of her name here. Um, it's the girl, Kristen. Uh, I had went to Kohl's yesterday, and I tried on some clothes, and I tried on 8s and 10s. The 8s did not fit me. Uh, I tried to squeeze in them, and I couldn't button them. But I'm almost there. So um, I did try that yesterday, but I ended up buying these shoes, okay? I don't know if you can see this really good. I love them. Um, I had a 30% off coupon, and um, I ended up got, these were $8, and I think I paid 6 or five eighty dollars or something like that plus tax, so this was great. And I can wear these with dresses or my, my capris or anything like that. And today, I went to the uh, secondhand store this morning, and I got me some capris and some shorts. They were size 10s. I did try a couple of eights on again, and I didn't really fit in the eights. I uh, couldn't button them up. I was like, oh, Angie Baby says. I was trying to squeeze 10-pound sack of potatoes in a 5-pound sack. You know what I mean? And um, and also, Niecy Dell said the funniest thing on her vlog. Um, she says, uh, she was talking about people. You know how women have buttons and, you know, when it's too tight, you know, as you're getting fatter and fatter and I got really fat over the years, you know, and uh, the buttons are busting out. And you got this big gaping hole right here. She said it's the buttons are screaming for mercy. I love that saying. I'm probably going to say that the rest of my life. That was so funny. Love you, Niecy Dell. And I love her medium tops. Who fits in mediums at 200 pounds? I wish I did. <laughs> I'm just now fitting in some mediums, mostly, you know, I don't know why it takes me so long to get to that. Maybe I'm a large frame, you know, but you look cute as a button and all that. A button. <laughs> anyway, um, today I made my soup at lunch, and as soon as I, I ate my lunch, I was running to the bathroom again. I think there's something out of whack still in my body. I don't know what it is. I really don't. I'm going to keep taking my vitamins, keep drinking what I'm supposed to be drinking, keep doing what I'm doing. I have decided to not do the distilled water anymore, and I've also decided no more lemon truffles for me on P2. As soon as I go to P3, I'll have them. And, um... I don't even know if I'm going to make the coconut butter till I get to P3, which I'm doing a short round, so it won't be much longer um, till my bottle runs out, which probably should be, you know, 25 days 
I'm guessing, you know, on the VLCD. We'll see. But uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll be in the 150s. And uh, I'm sticking straight and narrow right now. I just, I'm sort of late. I just made my strawberry slushy. Look at that, you guys. That is strawberry heaven. I can't even get it to show. That's strawberry heaven in the ninja, okay? Mm. Anyway, hopefully this won't make me run to the bathroom. But everything has made me run to the bathroom. So who, who cares anymore, okay? See this top here? I got this top a while back at Walmart on the clearance section. And when I was on P3 last time, I decided to make some heavy dobby mayonnaise, okay? <laughs> and I love that stuff. And I was putting it, I was eating it on something, and it spilled right there. And I have washed with my Oxy powder, I don't know how many times, to try to get the heavy dobby mayonnaise off my gray top. <laughs> And it won't come off. So, if anybody knows how to get oily stuff off of a top, I would really appreciate it. Tell me. Send me a message. Vlog about it. Uh, I want to say two things to, uh, I mean, uh, to two people out there. Uh, and anybody else feeling this way. Because I, I want to talk about something really quick. Uh, Littler Me with HCG and Juju for God. They both sort of felt like they weren't um, needed or uh, heard in the autism, uh, in the autism, listen to me talking about autism, in the uh, HCG community, but I'm here to tell you, the comments and the feedback that you both have given our community are invaluable. Both of you are like gems from God. I appreciate it every time you vlog and any time you comment. So don't ever think that we don't care about you. We all care. I care deeply about you both. And um, please continue to vlog, even if it's once a week or twice a week. You know, make a schedule and tell people, and then they're going to tune in to your channel. And right now, the my queue is full. I'm way behind on watching vlogs. But I get to them. And I enjoy each and every person that I get to, you know, share with, watch their journey. I was watching a new girl on here. I want to think her name is Seventh Goddess or something. You guys, she just made it to Wonderland. I wanted to jump up and down for her. You know, I mean, it was just fantastic. Every time I see somebody... And I, they're exuberant, and I just get so excited for them because I know the feeling when you leave the 200s, go to the 100s, when you're reaching your goal, you're getting closer to it, just like I'm getting closer to mine every day. Uh, anyway, that's what I wanted to share. And also that feelings aren't always the truth, okay? You can feel like nobody loves you, but I'm here to tell you God loves you, a lot of people love you. You just don't even know them yet. And it's sort of like the saying I put at the end of my vlog every time. The sun is always shining. Don't look at those stupid, nasty clouds that get in the way of the sunshine. The sun is always out there. Even when the earth is on a rotation and it's nighttime, the sun is still warming the earth. Okay? I promise you, in an indirect way, the sun is always there. So God's love... And our love is always there for you. So, that's how I'm going to end that today. And please pray for Rosanna and pray for some of the other people in our HCG community. Um, oh, Angie Baby needs your prayers. I'm not going to say just pray for her. There's been some other uh, people that have been sick this week from the distilled water. You guys be very, very, very careful with that. And um, don't stay on it very long. I mean, really go research this. Uh, I should have researched it a little more. And it, it seems like a great tool if you're going to detox before you start HCG. Maybe for a short period of time. But um, it only took me uh, on the 6th VLCD day to start having all those terrible symptoms. So be very careful. And um, I love you guys. Have a great day. Get some sunshine, make some vitamin D3, and um, I'll be checking in with you tomorrow on the VLCD. Peace out.